what it is what's good what's happening you feel me anyway what it is everybody it's your boy mike rich man what's happening with y'all today hope everybody each and every last one of y'all and every last and every last one of y'all is having a blessed blessed day to day man quick car sneaker review the lighting is trash so and then i'm on my phone camera so excuse the quality excuse the quality you know what i'm saying but we do stuff on the cuff around here you know what i'm saying when the opportunity presents itself we do stuff on the cuff um pair of sneakers right here sneakers you know what i'm saying uh i got what's the name too hey man i finally got my you know what I'm saying? i finally got that guy i got a bunch of uh cactus buddies from the uh adult happy meal i can't believe i'm talking about toys anyway uh, <laughs> i got about five of them cactus buddies i just kept getting them you know what i'm saying and i wouldn't eat mcdonald's to get it too i just buy the toys but now we got the hamburger shot Robo dobble anybody from the 80s remember he used to say Robo dobble Robo dobble he used to say that and he'd be running around after stealing, stealing the hamburger he did have four eyes back then though he didn't have four eyes that's some cactus uh, plant market uh, stuff that they doing. Flea market, cactus plant flea market. But he um he got his he got the red gloves on like Skip goes hard. Got his hands out like what? What? What y'all want to do? I got on a green tie. I got four eyes. I see everything. Hey, you talking about? And my hands out. Quick slap. Oh, uh, hey, you talking about? Anyway, um, shot the snacks for that. Also, I was getting so many of these. Some of those, so many cactus buddies, and he was getting so many of these right here. We just traded. I said, I'm not gonna go buy not one more McDonald's meal to get this uh this thing, man. Like I said, I don't even know what I'm gonna do with it. I, <laughs> it's like nostalgic, the thrill of the hunt. I have no idea why I'm getting this stuff because I ain't. I definitely ain't gonna do no resale on those damn toys. Um, but anyway, first of all, before I get into the shoes, I've been waiting on this package right here because it's dope and it means a lot and it's, it's respect man to one of the greatest who ever did it man. as you can probably tell in the background it is raining outside right now uh we've been had a drought in the city man we ain't been getting no rain you know what i'm saying when that hurricane came through florida we thought we were gonna get some of that rain we ain't getting that one drop so it's gonna be probably raining all day so i like it man I ain't, i'm one of them people that don't mind the rain man as long as i ain't got to be out working in it you feel me but anyway like i said gotta represent with this man i got this from uh anti merch uh it says, it says sacramento california now let me tell you something else real quick somebody hit me up in the dms and i did not answer the dm on purpose because i just i opened a shirt and i forgot what shirt it was but i said where the shirt came from on the package it's actually just it said kentucky something kentucky and i said that dude go hit me up man and sent me a uh a, a, a profile of that actual shirt being in a place in Atlanta. I had no idea. I don't know if they get distribution from this Kentucky place. I don't know if it's made somewhere else, but he showed me that this, these shirts was in Atlanta and was like, bro, you straight up lied on your video. Like, I care about somebody getting what I got. I don't care, bro. I'm not one of them type of people to be like, oh, I got the shirt. I don't want nobody to have it. When you get it from rich, don't even worry about it. You know, I'm not that type of person, bro. If anything, if a product, product is good and dope and I like it, I'm going to share it to let the people who make the product make more money. It's stupid. It's stupid, bro. It's stupid, guys. It's stupid. Is this camera on me? That's stupid. Use your common sense. Hey, you talking about? But anyway, let's go ahead and get into the, let's go ahead and get into this, man. I've been waiting to get this. Ooh, anti-merch. Yes, sir. Ski. I hope it fit right. I hate these tees. They've been making tees a lot lately. They just had this real, like, oversized, vintage, wide fit to it. I don't mind it being oversized, but wide? I'm already wide enough, man. I don't need no wide shirt. So, anyway, let me see if y'all can get y'all to see this. This is the front of the shirt right here. Representing Kobe Bryant's last game, the farewell game. Kobe Bryant, 60 points. Woo! Mamba out April 13th, 2016. Staples Center, Los Angeles, California. Kobe Bryant, best Laker of all times, in my humble opinion, man. 
And I know LeBron played for the Lakers now. I'm not even, I'm just, I ain't even talking about, I'm talking about to me. You know what I'm saying? I met with LeBron heavy, man, but Kobe, shout out. You don't hear about Kobe enough, man. I honestly don't think he in the conversation enough. Kobe was fire. And this, this shirt do look like it's going to fit good. So Mamba out, Staples Center, last farewell game, 60-point effort out of Kobe Bryant. Hey, tone back. And I got a, a few shoes that I can rock with that. I've been looking for something to rock with my, like, uh, Laker colorway sneakers that I got in my collection. So anyway, with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the shoes. Shoes, man. The shoes. Shout out to my guy, Snacks. But let me see these to review real quick. I was in the area. I stopped by. I said, let me get these. Let me review them for the channel. I ain't put up no uh, videos all week. So, you know what I'm saying? Just a little content for y'all. Plus, this shoe is an Atlanta-based sneaker. So, it's going to... I haven't seen a whole lot of reviews of this shoe online, man. So, let's go ahead and get into these. It says, Yard Runners. Yard Runners. I guess that's some, something that Nike got going on. Um, from what I'm hearing, it's like the band and the colleges and all that stuff like that, man. So uh, let's check these things out. Show how the yard runners. This is a Nike Dunk Low. C A U A K A. Ah, Clark University things. Yes, sir. Ski. Shout out to Snacks. This is Snacks. My boy Snacks, his size, size 14. Ooh. Snacks, man, he got a little paint on him, my boy. I wonder if he saw this. I don't know that. I ain't gonna try to take it off, but he got a little paint on him, boy. I don't like that. So anyway, this is the shoe. And as you can see, as I said, Snacks, your pair has a little defect action. I don't know if you're gonna be able to get that paint out or not, but it got a little paint action on. So anyway, this is the Clark Atlanta University Nike Dunk. I'm not really crazy about dunks. Y'all know I'm not the biggest dunk fan. Um, I don't know, that's a pet peeve looking at that paint, man. I just keep looking at it like, ouch. Ouchie. So this shoe is based on the Clark Atlanta University uh, Panthers. As you can see, Panthers on the tongue right there. Clark Atlanta University Panthers. You feel me? On, the, on these laces, it says, find a way or make one. You know what I'm saying? That's 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 life right there. Here you talking about. Find a way or make one. You feel me? I want to get this video up. I ain't want to go all the way to the house. You know what I'm saying? So I had to find a way. I had to make one. Ain't <laughs> anyway, this is the shoe. The leather is very, 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 very subpar. Uh, Plasticky looking leather, but you know, cardboard, whatever. They've been putting that on a lot of Nike Dunks this year. I love the colorway with the black, the gray, and the red. Kind of give you, uh, well, first of all, Clark Atlanta vibes. And then every time I see black, red, and white, I think Atlanta Falcons. Y'all know me being an Atlanta fan. Speaking of that, we got robbed against Tampa Bay. I don't care who the Tampa Bay. Shout out to my boy, oh, 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 easy money, the shoe guy. I know you a Tampa native, but y'all cheated. Your boy Tom Terrific cheated. Talking about some I don't throw the flags. Yeah, but you had a lot to do with that ref throwing flag. Remind me of back in the day when Michael Jordan used to stay sailor, and I love Michael Jordan. Y'all know I love MJ, but he used to sailor stuff to the refs, and they be like, okay, Michael, I believe you. I, I go, You know what I'm saying? Like, they'll go ahead and call the, call the uh, the uh foul or, or whatever because he was michael jordan tom brady gets that same treatment he been getting it for years but i hate that he got it like that against my Falcons because we was making a comeback on y'all ass and y'all called rough that weak rough in the passer call oh my god did y'all see it comment if you saw that rough in the passer call all you did was tackle them i don't even know how else you're supposed to get a person down to the ground how you supposed to do it shout it is it a rule? Is it an unwritten rule that we don't uh, tackle Tom Brady? Anyway, uh, <laughs> remind me of the Falcons colorway. I uh, got the 1988 on the back, and I'm guessing that's when Clark Atlanta University was founded. I was approximately six years old in 1988, so it's dope. Got the 1988 stitched in the back. Like I said, the leather is regular. It's some Reggie, it's some mid, but it'll do, you feel me? On the inside of the shoe, what does that say? Uh, Roach Street, I guess. Like I said, I don't even know if I ever even been to Clark Atlanta University, but being from Atlanta, but I, ain't, I guess I ain't had no reason to go down there. Um, but I like the laces. The laces has the metal lace tips on there. Fire, flamage, you know what I'm saying? And I just like the color of the shoe. You know what I'm saying? On the bottom, you have that Panther 
Clark Atlanta University Panther action going on in the clear outsole with the Panther up under it. Niceness. Um, usually I try to get every shoe that's Atlanta related to my city any kind of way, but I'm, I, I didn't go to college and I didn't go to this college, so. <laughs> um, you know, it's dope for the city, but you know what I'm saying? I, I think the people that actually went to the school should have the first dibs on the shoe. Uh, like I said, my guy Snacks, I don't know if you realize this, he ain't said nothing about it. I'm pretty sure he saw it though. It's a little paint defect going on. And this right here ain't nothing but like a lace or something like that. Ain't no big deal, but um, yeah, it's like a little paint defect right there. You know what I'm saying? How they get that little splatter of paint on them? And he actually got these, like, I was thinking they were super limited, which I think they are semi-limited. Um, I didn't realize the tongue was white. I thought it was gray. So the tongue is actually white uh, all the way down to the toe box and it's black. Wait a minute. I literally just realized this. <laughs> How the hell I got both of these shoes in my hand and I ain't realized they were two different colors. They were two different shoes. Two different color, they're the same color, they're two different color blocking. Um, okay, that's dope, that's dope. Both of them do have a white tone though. But one of them has the gray toe, gray side paneling, and a um, black toe box, and this one has the actually black toe, I mean the black toe cap and the black toe box. I mean, gray toe box and the black, y'all know what I'm talking about. They just swapped the colors out on the shoes, man. It's one of them is gray, where the black would be on the other shoe, one of them is black, where gray would be on the other shoe. And on this, this one it says, both of them does says 1988 on the back. I just noticed that. That just goes to show you how your mind, your brain has to connect with what you're actually looking at. Cause I started looking at this shoe like, they both the same color, but some different. And like, Rich, are you high? No, I'm not high. I just didn't, I didn't pay that no attention. Like I said, I didn't see anybody videos earlier. And I guess I don't have to see nobody videos to realize that this shoe is too, completely different uh has two completely different color blocking uh schemes going on so honestly i would like i wish they made a pair like this and they made a pair like that instead of both of them being the same shoe but that's just that's just a little small it ain't you know it's a little small thing that i got you know what i'm saying but they fought though, man which one would you like the best you like the right shoe or you like the left shoe the best i actually like the right shoe i like it with the uh gray color blocking around the toe uh cap i actually like the way this one look uh better than this this one right here I don't know, comment below and let me know. And like I said, y'all know I ain't the biggest dog fan, but hey, these are fire. I like the I like the uh, theme behind them. The back of this one says uh, Clark College. And the back of this one says um, Atlanta University. So Clark Atlanta uh, University, man. Actually come with red laces too. I didn't even, that's another thing I was gonna leave out. So a lot of times in these reviews, I do review and somebody, that's why I'm trying to remember everything because it'll be after the review over and people like rich you forgot this rich you forgot that about the shoe how can you not mention this you know what i'm saying so they do come with the uh laces that says find a way or make one and they come with red laces as well you know what i'm saying so what would y'all do would y'all put red lace in one shoe and leave the find a way in the other in the other shoe how would y'all drip them comment below and let me know i don't talk too much on this video that's the end of it it's probably because at the end of the video i actually realized that one of the shoes was gray. And this is the first shoe I held up when I was talking about the paint. And then the other shoe, you know, it has kind of like a more of a, it just looked like this is the black shoe and this is the gray shoe just because of uh, the color blocking on it. So anyway, that's it, man. I appreciate y'all for watching this video. Comment below and tell me what y'all think about the uh, CAU uh, Jordan, I mean, not Jordan, Duck Low CAU Yard Runner. Guys, let me know what you think about them, always. Um, Speaking of Georgia, shout out to them dogs. Y'all hit that thumbs up, like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon. Can he? To the moon on the, the voice. The voice ain't there. And keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Don't. Mike, Rich, no hype, just kick. Jordan, six.